Hey everybody, what's up? It's Clint Pulver, and we are here in the studio today talking about my brand new Yamaha drum kit that we're gonna be using on the 2023 speaking tour. So this year on the tour, I am playing Yamaha drums, always and forever have uh, been a Yamaha guy, absolutely love Yamaha drums. They're consistent, the craftsmanship, the sound, the technology behind it. It's just, uh, man, if you're a working drummer, there's nothing that tops Yamaha drums, in my opinion. I'm so excited to be playing the Yamaha Absolute Hybrid Maple kit. Uh, which has a lot of the similar technology to the Phoenix line. It's got that layer of Wenge surrounded by obviously the beautiful maple shells and it's just warmth, it's a tack, it, it's crisp, it cuts through and it's perfect for the live environments uh, that I'm playing in, whether it's a ballroom, an arena, um, even a smaller conference center. They're, they're, they're just the perfect drums and it's in a silver sparkle finish. Uh, the sizes I'm playing is an 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, and 18 tom. Uh, the bass drum's 22 inch, and the snare drum is a 14 inch snare. All of the hardware that I'm playing is a 700 series. Uh, I think the stands are perfect for lightweight, but also durability and strength. Uh, the pedal, I'm playing the FP9 direct drive double pedal, and Yamaha nailed this pedal. Uh, every drummer knows that your pedal is such a personalized, individualized experience because we all play differently. We all have different strengths, whether you know, you're playing metal, how you groove, the, the tension on the springs, and Yamaha literally figured out every way to adapt this pedal to the individual drummer's needs. And uh, man, if you get the FP9, it's the last pedal you will ever need in your life as a drummer. The, the durability, how it's built, and the adaptability on how you can customize it to your individual needs as a drummer is unreal. So shout out to Yamaha again for leading the way in everything that they do. Okay, so now let's talk about the Aquarian drum heads. I've been an Aquarian drum artist for a long time and I absolutely love this product. I'm playing the Response 2 on the top and then I'm playing the Classic Clears on the bottom. For these maple shells, it's just the perfect combination. On the bass drum, I'm playing the Force One. Uh, that, for me personally, is my very favorite bass drum head that Aquarian offers. You hit that bass head and it just sounds like thunder. The ground shakes, it sounds the way a bass drum is supposed to sound. On the snare drum, I'm playing the triple threat on the top and then on the bottom side, I'm playing, uh, again, a classic clear with the snare side. The triple threat's an amazing head. It's three plies, uh, seven millimeter film on, on that, and it's just durable, the strength, but also the responsiveness and, and the clarity, the attack that you get from this head is, is perfect for the type of music and the show that we're producing this year on the tour. So, man, you cannot go wrong with Aquarian drum heads. Again, the consistency, durability, and the variety that they offer is unlike anything else that's out there on the market. Okay, so I play all Zildjian cymbals. Um, always have and have been a Zildjian artist since day one and love their support, their craftsmanship, their durability. They've been around forever. And on this kit in particular, I'm playing the both A and K lines. And so let's talk about the cymbals. Right here, this little guy in the middle is a custom hybrid splash. This is in the nine inch size. Again, a K line, beautiful cymbal. And then we jump over to the A series, which is an 18 inch rock crash. And then probably my most favorite symbol on the whole kit is the K Suite 19 inch symbol. I, I think Zildjian just absolutely killed it with the K Suite line. Love this line, love this symbol. And then last on this side is the 19 inch um, custom special dry crash. And again, a beautiful symbol to just cut through and add a little bit of dynamic on that left side. And then if we jump over here, we've got the custom hybrid ride symbol. This is in a 20 inch. And uh, I love this ride symbol, cuts through, beautiful, dynamic. And then another effects symbol. This is the Zill Bell. And uh, when you need that extra little ping, uh, this guy does the job. And then over here, we've got my China symbol. Again, very similar to the other 19 inch in that special dry line that, that the K symbols offers. Um, love the sound and how this bites and cuts through 
uh, the way a China symbol should. And then lastly here up above, absolute classic, the A Custom. Uh, this is a 20 inch symbol um, from the A line, beautiful symbol. And again, adding the dynamics that I need uh, for the music that I'm playing. So now let's jump down to the hi-hats. My main hi-hat is a 14 inch fat hat. Again, a K-line symbol. I'm so glad that Zildjian brought the fat hats back. Uh, the warmth, the dynamic, the, 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 the brightness that you still get from these symbols. It's just a perfect combination uh, that works for the music that I'm playing. And then to marry that to the fat hat, for my auxiliary hi-hat, I've got the classic New Beats, uh, also in a 14-inch configuration. And these two paired together um, for the music, for the show, the dynamics that are needed, uh, it's just a perfect marriage. So the sticks that I play are the Vic Firth Customs, and they've got my signature on the sticks. Underneath it says, be the best for the world, um, which is a part of the brand and obviously the speaking tour itself. I play the American Classic 5A Extremes. The Extreme version is just a little bit of a longer stick, and that just helps with the reach, and also this the specific dynamics that I use and need as a player. I absolutely love Vic Firth, the quality, the craftsmanship, the balancing, um, and the legacy that these sticks uh, mean for me in my own life. Uh, they really are the quintessence of, of drumsticks. You can't go wrong. Um, so thank you, Vic. Okay, that pretty much wraps it up for the new kit for the 2023 speaking tour. Uh, I'm super excited. I hope you guys enjoyed this. And really quickly, before we end, I just wanna talk about the people that stand behind these products because they're equally as amazing. Uh, Wes Kreitz with Yamaha Drums, thank you for everything that you've done to support me, my mission in this world, and what we're trying to do with these instruments. Um, so shout out to Yamaha Drums, Wes Kreitz, thank you. Chris Brady at Aquarian Drum Heads. Chris, you have always been there. If I pull a head, a head breaks. Um, if I need to try something new or I'm trying to get a different sound, your support, your mentorship, and your care, um, I'll never forget you for it. So thank you, Chris. I'm also a big proponent of supporting your local drum shops. So shout out to Sean and the whole crew and the gang at Salt City Drums, uh, an incredible drum shop. Sean, you have always been uh, just a major support for me and uh, you've always been there uh, before any of this was there you and Salt City Drums were there for me and still to this day you're there for me so support your local drum shops and thank you Salt City Drums and then lastly Joe Testa and the amazing team at Vic Firth and Zildjian your care for consistency quality and the customer service that you have always given me um, is something I just cherish and it means the world as a working drummer to not just have beautiful instruments, beautiful products, but to also work with amazing people that stand behind these products. Uh, I could not do it without them. And again, thank you to you, all of the fans, the audiences, the organizations that support me and my message to truly be the best for the world. Thank you for watching, thank you for the support, and we'll see you on the 2023 Speaking Tour.